everybody. So we've checked out a south view um, Park Dean. We're actually the last part of our trip. We're going to the cottages at the nurseries and it's taking us down some country lanes. Now I'm hoping it's not going to get narrow. It feels a bit like deja vu in uh, Wales. And there's a dip each side which uh, it's not good. But at least it's dry. It's dry and the weather, it's gone really sunny. Um, now checking is four o'clock. Um, we am a little bit early. Well, two hours early. <laughs> so, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if we're going to be allowed uh, to go on site or what. Usually with that Haven or Park D, you go on site and grab a coffee or whatever. But Mumbai's, um, I think it's in the middle of nowhere. It's lovely out here. It's, the sun is shining and I actually, it does feel warm, doesn't it? It does well in here, it does. I just, this is it's random, right? I just went in Tesco's and there was a man on the till and he was talking to the, the couple in front and he was saying oh tea cakes so they must have purchased some do you mean hot cross buns is that what you mean by well tea he cake? called i don't i don't look but he says tea cakes so i don't know and she was like she loves the tea cakes she has two centimeter thick butter and cheese on and i'm thinking did i get cheese and the man was like, cheese? What kind of that? And he was giving on. And yeah, apparently she loves a uh, hot cross, no, tea cakes. With cheese on, I've never heard of that one before. That's just wrong. And I'm sorry for today. And I'm sorry for today. Two for luck. No, I'm sorry, two for joy. I reckon we're going to be able to get in our cottage early. Or oh, who knows? Anyway, yeah cheese on a tea cake now this lady i'm not very good at guessing ages i would say she's probably mid 60s and apparently it was what her father used to give her so what i don't know what kind of food that is but what freaks me out a little bit is how does she know it's two centimeters above i don't know she get a ruler? i mean two centimeters i don't know she must just cut her wet i mean who has thick butter like that yeah, i love I'm trying not to eat bread. On holiday, I've been having a slice here and there. But back at home, I won't be having bread. But just a slice of toast with butter is beautiful. But how on earth can you be two centimetre thick butter? I have no idea. Look at the stunning houses round here. Look at that front house. That is gorgeous. Some beautiful properties round here. Um, Posh. So yes, I th uh, we just Hogsthorpe. on Hogsthorpe. We are actually at now. I don't know how far away are we. Uh, two and a half miles. I think. A lot of uh, bungalows around here empty. So uh, a lot of properties we've seen, but some beautiful places. Anyway, when I go, cause uh, I sit my coffee, but. Tea cake with two centimetre thick butter and cheese. I wouldn't eat that for the. Honestly, I couldn't eat that if that was all left. But anyway, I shall see you all later. Bye. Do you want to say bye? See you later. <laughs> so, we're here at the nurseries. I've just got our keys. I'm going to go and show you around. Turn it round. There you go. So, now I have been inside because um, just have a quick look. Now you walk in, it's huge. Now I've took my shoes off because it's actually um, the heating is underneath, so you can actually feel it as you walk around. So this is the kitchen. I mean, we have seen it on a video. It is huge. Look at this for a kitchen. Massive table. 
fridge freezer, American. I've always wanted an American fridge freezer. Beautiful. Um, huge telly on the wall. Big range cooker. Yeah, smells lovely. Got some tea and coffee and sugar there. I've actually brought sugar because we don't take it, but I think uh, Mark and Diane from Bar Eds do. So, so let's just take you through. This goes to the back garden. There's two doors. Well, I say two doors. It's it's um I don't know what you call them, but it's one of them big doors that's split in two. This is your room with your washer, dryer, and dishwasher. Utility room, I think. This is your downstairs shower, wet room. Beautiful. All smells lovely and fresh. So. Yes, that's the garden. I shall go at the end of it. It's a lovely set, eh? Yeah. Very nice. Right. This is massive. I mean, in the house, I can usually get about um, without my stick, but so he's got uh, your double room double um your two single beds i should say very nice got your pine wardrobe and your mirror this is one big house especially for just me and andy right go through again well oh, it's wonderful ground floor in the heating whatever you call it it's beautiful so this is the living room and it's like a log fire, which you probably wouldn't need anyway, because you've got the heating. Big telly. Huge room. You've got your two doors there to the back garden, which I shall do in a bit. It's weird, I've seen this video, uh, I find the house looks bigger actually, when you come to see. Right, now, I, find I can't get up the stairs, so I'm going to have to pause this a minute, just a sec. Oh God, I'm out of both. right. And then you got this, now, now this is, um, a six foot bed, big super king, because we've got a big super king at home. That is that is lovely. Big wooden sleigh bed. Not love that uh, bedside cabinet. I shall be ringing my bell outside there for Andy to make me drinks. TV in the wall, perfect. Oh, my breath. Little walking wardrobe. Now this is all sweet, I believe. That is gorgeous. That's a jacuzzi bath. Oh God, I don't think I'm going to be able to get in there. I'll have a go, but... This is lovely. Very nice. You can see the new lodges. Beautiful. Yes, I like this thing. Very nice, that. That is a big bath. It's like deep and you've got the lovely um, headrest, but it's just getting in there. I don't think I'll be able to get in. So, right then. Very nice. I could live in here, actually. Now, you've got this. Let's have a look if the doors are open. Yeah, up the blinds. So when I um when I do see um Diana Mark Bowerheads walking up, I might see them just walking past here. Um, I'm gonna have to ring my bell. So 
lovely uh, table and chairs outside. God, it's really warm for March. So, yes, I am liking this a lot. Right then, comes with some towels, I think. Oh, well, I've already packed our towels. So, let's look in these other rooms. Another bed. So, if you could come a big family, maybe, I don't know, out on Christmas, um, you could all have Christmas together. There's plenty of bedrooms. Lovely wooden bed. Bedside cabinet. And you've got the chest of drawers to match. And I imagine at night, this is going to be so peaceful. Very nice. Right, last room to go in. I'm not sure if this is a... Oh, this is just like a, a cubby hole to keep the odd bits there. Very nice. Right then, I'm going to go downstairs. Let me just open this up. I'm going to go out um, and have a look outside at the um, the hot tub. So I'll see you in a bit. Oh, out of off. Oh, I can't do with the lift in this house. <laughs> right then, let's go and have a look um, in the garden at the hot tub. So Andy will be in there later. So we're ringing my bell and he'll be out here escaping. Right, let's just turn your head. That is one big hot tub. Yeah. I mean, it's, I don't know how many that holds, but that looks bigger than the one at um, Hemsby. So, nice garden. Right, I'm going to get him relax anyway. Cup of tea, cup of coffee for me, and uh, peanut. He's loving it here. Anyway, I'm going to get him relax. See you in a bit. We are now at the nurseries, 90% settled in. My wife's cream crackered. The dog's loving it here. The cottage is bigger than it looks, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, the uh, grounds of the nurseries is smaller than what I thought it was, but the cottage is bigger. The dog's got a huge garden. I mean, we have got a garden at home, but it's probably half the size of this, so he's uh, exploring out there. 3.4? <laughs> it pulls on me foot. Uh, so, we'll probably do a bit more vlogging, videoing later on or tomorrow at the hot tub there I can actually hear it come on and uh, yeah you know when you're knackered, you're too tired you're too tired to go in this uh, hot tub I need a shower which that's my first port of call and then probably something Please to eat. Show the ball still on my foot. Where the dog's put the ball? Balance it on my foot. That's Peanut's special way of saying, come on, come play with me. He wants to throw the ball. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end this very quick one. Um, uh, I'll see you in the next one. You have a good one and a safe one. And I'll, I'll see you later. Bus to your room in a minute. <laughs> I need to catch a bus and the living room. We need our scooters to get to the living room. <laughs> I mean, we've got. Sorry, this is. I'm waffling. We've got a big house anyway. Um, 
well it's not a big house but it's, it's big, big rooms big room. uh, this is probably I would say a little bit bigger than our house I suppose it's bigger isn't it it is bigger I mean our living room and kitchen downstairs the hallway's 18 yeah but this has got bedrooms downstairs as well as the bathroom yeah and to get from here to the living room it's quicker to go in the garden <laughs> yeah to go in the garden <laughs> just go out them doors into the garden you go out those doors and around and then there's, into there's, the there's doors into the living room there double doors it's quicker to cut through so anyway yes See you in the next one. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, uh, we've got a couple of gorgeous guests. We paid them a lot of money. Yeah. We're still at the nursery. I got one to be free. And you can guess who they are. They are Bo Ettel Tor. And their lovely wife. Almost forgot about her. Yeah, <laughs> typical. I mean, a good old now. Really lovely people. I shall see you in the next one, and what do you say? Stay safe. Good morning. So we're actually on the balcony, uh, in the yeah, upstairs in the house. You can see the view at the back. Uh, everybody's done the nurseries to death, so you can always watch other people's footage. Um, we've done a little bit. I don't but think they, they've done one. From the balcony. I, I'm no, but I'm on about people have walked around the site, so we don't really need to do that. Everybody's seen that, but it's a nice day. And yeah, give us the camera. See, this gonna... is how close you are to the farm. Yeah, the farm's just there. It's literally just there. You don't hear anything. Well, we haven't heard anything. No. Peanut. Come here. There is a horse, and I don't know if you could pick that up. Just. There, probably can't pick that up. See if I can zoom in on that. Peanut, come uh, on. That's not zoomed in, that. Wait. Just there. Yes. Uh, I know it's a horse, and there's horses everywhere, but uh, just, yeah, it is. just nice. It is. I mean, we've got to talk. To you about that. So that's all quiet because it is still early. People are probably having a lie in. Um, but. Um, it's, it's a nice site uh, if you're after peace and quiet, no one disturbs you here. Um, I mean, we've enjoyed our weekend in here, haven't we? We've mm. met up with um, our friend Balted on tour, um, had a nice chat with them, a cup of coffee. Um, but yeah, if you're looking for a, um, a few days away uh, where you don't get disturbed and stuff, come here. I mean, there isn't nothing on site as you like you do Haven. Uh, clubs and whatever. Um, well, it's it's in the middle of nowhere, lovely and quiet. So I definitely recommend it. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So that nice little sun trap actually. Yeah. Don't feel the wind up here. No. You feel like oh, get it, the drone it is up. quite windy, so maybe you can go and get the drone up, you know, and uh, show you from above, hopefully. Um, We've had a lovely weekend anyway, just time to chill, relax um, before we head off home and then we head off again. <laughs> yes, we charge our batteries. So, uh, and, uh, so to speak. <laughs> right. Uh, so I've... we're going to do a bit of packing. Yeah. Uh, to be honest, it's quite warm, it's making me a bit. Uh, well, you get your bikini on and uh, got no chance. Uh, I can't fit in it. I did bring my um, it's I don't know what it's, it's not in costume, it's the top and bottom like shorts. Uh, is it tank tankered or oh, I don't bloody know. I did bring that because the chikus are here, but I don't think I'll fit in it after what I've been eating. So <laughs> back to me uh, salad when I get home. So I'll tell you what, it, it's bloody nice and warm up here. So, I think this is it anyway. We'll uh, go and pack some stuff. Have you panned around the back? Have you? No, you can do the, the honours. You just get the camera and just show you all of you all around the balcony. So, as I said, you're literally a stone's throw away from the farm. Um, yeah. 
but uh, as I said, don't you know, not always we have them. I'm you. guessing that at certain times of the year, it probably gets a bit noisy, uh, but that, thing, you're next to a farm, there's nothing you could do about it. Land. Another thing is, I did mention it's four bedroom, it's three bedrooms, you've got two upstairs and then one downstairs. One downstairs. Um, I was saying to Andy, because um, for us two, we do cheap as chips, this wasn't cheap for us, uh, it's gone a lot of treated really. Uh, but um, I can imagine Christmas time uh, coming here, because there's a log fire, um, it, it would just be beautiful, cutting the turkey with all your family here uh, at Christmas. That's, if that's something you like, it's worth considering. I'm not sure how much it is, um, but you can always split it between there yourselves. Is, uh, yeah, there is a log burner in log the burner, yeah, log fire. front room. I mean, we've uh, not used it because it's we don't £10 need to. the bag if you use their bags. Yeah, I think you buy the uh, Kindle as well, and there's the. I think fire starter. Right next to the, right next to the fire, there's a, a big basket of um, bags of wood. It's ten pound for a bag. I'm guessing it's like honesty. So, if you use a bag, you uh, pop into the reception and give them ten pounds. It'll probably be cheaper if you go to a petrol station and, and get your own. If I'm honest, but uh, that's just me. But yeah, very nice. Anyway, this is the pan of the place. Well, from as above as you can get it. Without a drone. Without a drone. So, yeah, this is it. You it's about too soon because the sun's gone in. The sun <laughs> has gone in. And you look tiny. You look like you're, you're I wish like I was. only two foot tall. I wish I was tiny. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yes. Very nice. I can imagine in the red up weather here. Yeah. Cold glass of uh, well juice for me because I don't drink. It'd be beautiful. Mm -hmm. Soon catch the sun. So. You would. So, are we going to end this here? Yeah. Uh, anyway, I'll speak to you later. You have a good one. And uh, stay safe. And stay safe. I'm trying not to burn the kitchen down. I've got the door open there. And a window open there because I'm cooking the dog's steak. Uh, I put it on the wrong, the wrong ring. Uh, it was the big ring, and um, yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, all fun and games. This is probably the last thing we'll cook here, and then uh, that'll be it. We'll. Uh, we're popping off to Ingemel's tonight, get back, do some packing, last bit of packing, and then uh, we'll get up in the morning, have some brekkie, and then uh, we'll um, travel off home. And, uh, see you then. I think she's uh, still vlogging, so. Catch you in the next one.